your Lord. Please grant me the courage and strength to carry out your will. I dedicate my life to serving you and your son, and I shall do my best to protect him above all else. Taxes! Taxes for Herod and Caesar! We need money to feed our children, not to line the pockets of Rome. Cut off his hands! No, no, no! 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 People have had enough. Herod has gone too far. I do not agree with Herod's methods, but hate only fuels civil unrest. What do you suggest? Compassion. Love. We have followed the sign of the star and have come to pay homage. God's messenger said that this child would bring a great light into this world. I feel blessed, but I don't understand why he chose me. You will make a wonderful father. We come to bear witness to the child, to the one who's been born king of the Jews. I am king of Judea. This child is destined to make many in Israel fall. This ends tonight. Slay the child. We have to go. He has been sent from God as an example for all of humanity. Your son warms my heart in ways that I cannot explain. My Heavenly Father forgives us for our sins. No, he does not. Shall we not love our enemies as we love our neighbors? Tell us your name. Jesus of Nazareth. This boy is our son. We will raise him to grow strong, to be filled with wisdom. And God's grace will be upon him. Your inner peace can only come from forgiveness. Do not have to slay your enemy. Instead, let the hand of God tend to him. work as your earthly father has done. Your father in heaven will guide you. There's something special about Jesus that I cannot ignore. My eyes have seen it and my heart has felt it. Prophecy has come to pass.